Shut up, y'all. It's your girl, Molly Perky Sets. And I'm gonna spotlight some forgotten dude props with some unsung heroes. These are my top five ladies that have touched history in some, um, unconventional ways. Number five. Lauren Sanchez. Lauren Sanchez is a reporter and news anchor that dropped her anchor right in the middle of Jeff and Mackenzie Bezos' marriage, leading to the biggest divorce settlement in U.S. history, which in turn made Mackenzie the fourth richest woman in the world. Way to help a sister out, Lauren. Although Mackenzie did help him basically build Amazon, but still, way to exit stage rich. Number four, model V. Stiviano recorded the racist rant of then Clippers owner Donald Sterling, causing him to be banned from the NBA, which led to the sale of the Clippers to Steve Ballmer. Not only did the Clippers have seven consecutive winning seasons, they also hired their first major female executive, Gillian Zucker, as the president of business operations. Come on, y'all. V was porking this. Now that's taking one for the team. Number three. Lisa Bonet and Jason Momoa might be getting divorced now, but she stuck by her man through hard times, grooming him into the Aquaman that's making us all want to go out and f*** a fish. Catch. I said catch a fish. Don't be bleeping me. Number two. Speaking of fish sticks, <laughs> Josie Butler, a nursing activist, was protesting the TPPA when she hopped the rubber dildo that ever so gently swaffled the nose of New Zealand politician Stephen Joyce as he spoke to journalists. Swaffle, the art of penis to face slapping. Oh, things are just flying everywhere. Swaffle. I'm actually happy with the new open carry laws. And my number one unsung hero, Ilona Staler, or Chicholina, a Hungarian-Italian, former porn star, politician, and singer, was elected to the Italian parliament in 1987. Yo, she offered to have sex with Saddam Hussein in return for peace and gave the same offer to Osama bin Laden. She often uncovered her left breast when giving speeches to show her support for the left. Joe Manchin, you watching? I'm just saying, if they're still doubting which side you're on, you might wanna brandish your left testicle at the next Senate hearings. I mean, he looks like he hangs to the left. And way before Game Over Reedy challenged y'all strong loyalty, Ilona had her own ode to the Magnum D-I-C-K. Alright y'all, like, subscribe, and let me know who your favorite unsung female heroes are. Till next time, keep your girls in check. Check them.